your host and welcome to the campus celebrity show brought to you by campus style and we are here our venue if you want to know today is Nel Jardino where you have a beautiful environment as you can see behind us you can see a beautiful garden they, they give uh, they give services and events they give services in bar and drinking and parties that you can host most of your programs here and my makeup was done by yours truly Palazzo makeover. Now, I will take you into today's program, and today we have a beautiful person with us. And well, she's also a familiar face on campus at KTU. So if you've heard of the name Aso, then you probably know who I'm talking about. But before we bring her to the scene, we're taking a quick break, and then we'll join you again. Thank you. Hi. Welcome back and as you know this is the campus celebrity show and today we have with us a beautiful person and let me not waste time in fact Akwaba Honorable Dina Miss Aso you're welcome yes. to the campus celebrity show. Thank you. It's an honor to have you here this evening. I'm also honored to be here. Thank you. Now, me pacho. Yes, aso, aso, ufaha, aso, ufaha, aso. 
Kids used to say the Yatia saw some Yatsi. They see and tell us who I saw this. Okay, thank you. I saw is a beautiful young lady, um, a free spirited person. I vibe with positive people with positive vibes, and then all the time, Obia. Contact, I try to make good impact in people. I'm not quick tempered, I flow with everybody. Yes. Oh, and Tawantawa they say, oh, but that is not me. Yes, I'm so glad you are here today. And Miss Aquap, Miss, in fact, before we go in there, mm -hmm. Me free kede. Kede? Yes. Yeah, be any more, so no. I'm sure some of us don't know where kede is. It would be a chair of kwan any young. Oh, kede dear. And yeah, you are kwan. Ufa kede ka o um koforidia station and udua samaya or sna se akwitia buedia dan crono no edu kede. Ti kede dear. And yeah, you are kwan kra. That's <laughs> viewers. Now you know your way to kede in case you didn't know. Now one question we've been dying to ask this young lady is Miss Asso, Honorable, how was your upbringing? How has it been for you till this very moment? Mm. Well, it hasn't been easy. Yes, even biblically, God never gave a promise that our life journey on earth was going to be easy. Yes. So growing up at Kede, starting school at Pentecost, going to Advent Reformed Institute. Now, okay, Pentecost, na Pentecost, no. Aye, Asori ni school, na say, no so aye. Oh, aye, aye, Asori Pentecost. They say, eh, Asori, but na Penny be a oko Asori wo Pentecost. Your friend is su Papa. Hey, yes, Papa. Yes, Joseph. Eh, yes, Mama. I'm not much hey. at school, no. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm not much at school, no. But I'm just saying, no. Ebe ye, no. Happy home. But I'm not much at school. I say, oh, honey, I'm a friend of Pentecost. Okay. And I'm just like Advent through mm -hmm. Advent class one. And I'm a cut to ask, oh, how many pa? I didn't tell you, die. Happy home, no. Oh, I happy mean, home! Nene, a day came, kwa. Oh, okay. Enti me kwa crash niwe ye you no. Know. And I'm kwa share ne juni kg no wo baby ya yes. Enti me kwa share ne um kg one kg into class one. Ewo Advent Reformed Institute. And I'm a jibe to us wo. How many pa memorial preparatory school? Ewo kedi. Yeah. Okay. Now, eh hono so na we we really want to know especially just connect us from there to Katie. Connect us between those two places. Okay. And throughout the academic life, well, I'm many panel. When I go to class five, now my papa per se, we me free, I'm many pa, no, they may call government school because not free education, abba. But my teachers, nay, headmaster, no, looking at how brilliant and clever I was in school, they didn't agree to the fact that my daddy should so move. So, were me. you always first in class? Were oh, you right from childhood, I was always first in class. And then, just away yes. a scholar, yeah, yeah. oh, just away a scholar, <laughs> right from a childhood, bishop. first, 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 uh, auntie, yes. Na ye you may free school because of free education, no, na your headmaster and some penny. And so that academic um year no or oh, he, he said he said that if I am able to maintain my position as a first um as the first in class he would give me a scholarship, scholarship. and it happened so right from class five through till I completed JHS. You were on yes, I was on scholarship. Brilliant, brilliant. Yeah. So what brought you to KT? Katie. Why in all, as a brilliant student, as you've told us, you had scholarships, you were announced to be one of the best students in your JSS. What made you choose KTU above every other school? Oh, yes. And what My least grade was C5. Wow. Yes, wow. my least grade was C5 yet. Now, and, on, and you decided to come to KT? Yes, growing up through Ghana Senior High School, Koforidia, I had interest and passion for journalism. You went to Ghana Senior High School? Yes. Oh, 
Ganas. Ganas. Mundi po. Be kid. Shine. Okay. Okay. <laughs> That's what Yes, and so passing through Ghana Senior High School, growing up, I had passion for journalism, but every year school, one and two delay answers be, and then I developed interest in fashion. It was like, so, the way I see things with regards to fashion, what I wear, the way I appear, the way I present myself, I saw that I w if I enter into the fashion, it would do me, yes, it would do me. And it has brought something uh, that, that was hidden in me. It has really brought it out. Mm -hmm. And I found it very convenient to be in the um, technical school to study fashion than any of the years. So I chose to be in Koforidia Technical University. Yeah. I, would, I would also give comments to that decision. Yeah. I personally have also believed that to have the practical you know understanding you'd have to you know to, to go to a, to a practical school and that is the technical universities now yeah two year nine is your bounty and samba now you're bad if you freak a crab it now we're going for a short break we'll be right back and when we come back we're going to a different level see you I Yo, yo, this is your Daryl Bay in my life. Been a one far, been a far. Mess it on the bra, bra, bra. Yo, this is the Daryl Bay once again. You know what it is. Bless up couple style. Big up to Uno Yaman. Yeah, Uno I work, work hard. Boom, clap. Welcome back. This is your favorite show, the Campus Celebrity Show, brought to you by Campus Style, and we are live at our venue today, which is the Nell Galdino. And thanks to Palazzo Makeovers for this beautiful makeup. Now, before we went, we introduced you to our guests. But as we come back, Miss Asso, we want to know more about you. I want to ask you, in your period here in Koforidia Technical University, mm -hmm. why the need? Why did you find it? I mean, at the end, I show one crying, say, won't come miss a father. Oh, thank you for this question. Yes, contesting for the Aquaba was something I already had as part of my plans coming to school. When I see people contesting for pageants, their attitudes, how this pageant shape their gestures, how to talk, how to present yourself, what to say in public, when to talk, how to answer questions and all that. Getting to know all that people are learning and it is adding value to their social life um, motivated me to also join the pageant to mm -hmm. make it shape my attitude to the public. So would you say that your attitude before, your attitude before having this desire was something you wanted to give up to have something else? No. Um, as I said earlier, it would add value. Add value. Yes, okay. it would add value, and it would, it it, would, it created it has created um, a page for me to learn more. Okay. Yes. So, how has your experience been in this Miss Aquaba? Oh, it has been a very great experience right from rehearsals, going through the tough times, 
up and downs and learning how to model for the first time though you had the passion like you feel you can do it mm -hmm. but it wasn't as easy as i saw it mm -hmm. but i pursued and i persisted and in the whole corner not just say Exactly my point. Uh -huh. yeah. Then dear, I think you had a great experience. I did, but I did. we believe there is more to that experience than you are telling us. Yes. Because we know the organizers of this program are very own SRC. Um, you must have benefited in some ways from you know the council you know from from the council so tell us a bit more what were the benefits what what have you been able to gain out of the competition what is the relationship basis now give us something more okay in terms of receiving prizes it hasn't come yet okay yes it hasn't come yet. viewers you are hearing it from miss aquaba miss Aso herself yes. that the prize that is given to the winners of the pageantry has not been presented to them. Now, how does that make you feel? Well, I don't really feel good, though that is not the reason I contested yes. for the pageant. Yes, at least in its right way, appropriately, I feel after every pageant, and that is what we see in our societies, whatever pageants that you experience, at the end of the competition, people are giving prizes. Yes, right from the winner to whoever participated. Yes, but I, I with this Aquaba pageant, I haven't received anything of that sort. And, um, well... I won't say I am really bothered about that because that is not the reason. reason why yes, I contested went. for the pageant. So, price or no price, I'm coining and yeah. This is Miss Asso. She's beautiful, like I said before. Mekayana Menbo says she's beautiful. <laughs> she's vibrant. She's intelligent. And she's got gas. Miss Asso, we know that you are part of the debate society yes and <laughs> what what are the activities that you take place there? because it's any who's any of one friend plan it's a bit it's it's seeming emotional so give us something what are the activities what what is going on with you in there in the debate society? yes yes oh, the debate society getting um initiating uh, initiated into the debate society has really done me a good help yes i remember on one of our meetings we were taught how to talk in public at the end of your presentation at the end of whatever thing that you are mm -hmm. talking mm -hmm. about you shouldn't create conflict yes. yes and a good public speaker too you should be versatile yes. at the end of the day whoever is present should understand and comprehend whatever thing that you are delivering yes so joining the debate society has really really done me a very good mm. help yes your the way you you carry yourself uh, in public talking Mami to the crowd Jawani, what is the current status of the debate society of Kofuridia technical university current status yes what is the status what is where is it now where is it oh it's on campus in campus <laughs> What are the activities that are you are you know participating in over there? Uh, debates, um, debates, um, debatable questions are brought on board, and it will, it will be thrown to the house, and then we sit and toss our minds on how to present it. We organize debate competitions among ourselves. We go outside to have debate competitions with other schools, and we come out victorious. Mm. Yes. Okay. So, in your capacity as the Miss Aquaba, mm -hmm. what intentions do you have for the, the societies that you are part of, such as the debate society and you know the school in general? What what do you, intentions do you have towards them? Yes, I, um, I would I would love that the school and the the administrative board of the school would have the debate society at heart. Cause and why do you of, think so? Yes, 
my, with my experience how personal I have taken this debate society from the way I see it and the way it is helping me you know I feel that this the school should really have the debate society at heart I would even love that they would even have a debate committee a debate group of people in every department so maybe at the, in the middle of a semester or at the end of a semester we organize debate competitions among the departments because joining such a society it built it makes you broad knowledgeably broad yes so, and so then, were you aware of the previously just recently held faculty debate or? yeah i was around but i didn't experience didn't yes I didn't, yes i didn't participate okay now let, let's go to a different skill all right are you in a relationship Hmm, yes. That's what I'm What do you fear saying? Oh, maybe 23. Maybe 23. Yes, June, maybe 24. Oh, you are young. Viewers, hey, I'm a big young. girl, though. She. Now, let, 24 and 23 is not question. easy. See if she's available on it. Because I know some of you would say, I'm a man, I'm a man, I'm a man. I'm a Mm-hmm. Are you single? Are you attached? Is it complicated? Where are we? Oh, I'm attached. You are attached? Yes. How serious is it? Oh, very serious. Eh. Mm. Do we know him? I don't know if you know him. Ah, <laughs> we will find out. When we come back from this break, we will find out. <laughs> Bestie, looking sexy, but I don't wanna say what up people this be your boy Mullet. Charlie keep on watching Camp Foot Style and make make you not forget to subscribe. I be you know keep it like bless you. This is still the campus celebrity show and I am your host Dina Benson and our guest is Miss Aso. Miss Aso, I said no no me be sound patch for my my answer mommy. I said me. Me say. Do we know him? Eh, I don't know if you know him or yo. What do you mean to ask? Now, I said my me me person be sound to see and me say. Miss Akwaba. Miss Asso, to say an abadanim papa. I know a year from now, a period from now, you give up the crown. But before that period, what do you intend to do? Oh, there are a lot that I intend to do on campus. There are one and two things that I've observed. When you look around the area of um, the AD block, yes. The place is very dark and looks scary. Do you stay at Get that, Fund? No. Yes, Get Fund area. I would believe that you'd stay at Get Fund. That is why you have this gym. Oh, no, 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 no. I stay at okay. Junction 6. Oh, okay. Yes, but looking at how dark the place looks mm -hmm. at night, during this examination, that people will be mm -hmm. going to campus to study. Right. They'll be passing years. True. People will be quashing them and all that. Mm -hmm. So um, I, together with my people, are planning to fetch um, street lights over that area. And then the Faculty of Built and Natural Environment, too, we are planning to paint and right from the entrance at the back of the FBNE block there's some fence construction going there so okay. yes we work on all that and there are a lot of um, talent shows that we are planning to bring up on campus and all that well. yeah it seems you you have yourself together oh you, yes you, you're fully I, I guess it's fully packed she has herself together now Miss Asso and there's another you. rumor rumor are you a politically inclined person? Politically inclined? Not really. You're not a politician. Yeah, I'm not a politician. You're not interested in the affairs of politics. Mm, not really. Why? Mm, as for politics, 
I don't really have interest in engaging so much into politics but if something is supposed to be done and it is not done in its right way and I feel I should talk about it I'll talk if something has been done and it is good fine if it is done and it is bad that's just the way it is but I don't really have politics at heart yeah so do you think politics actually has a big role in the affairs on on, on, on campus? Campus politics. I have heard though. I mean, they have um, political societies on campus like Tescom and some other societies. Yeah. Well, very soon I'll let you go. Sure. Now, some Mm -hmm. Yet the But before that, let me ask you what do you plan to do with yourself from here? What do you plan to do with yourself as a human being, as someone who has attained these graces, you know, this favor before people? People love you on campus, people see, oh, this is rare. Hey. <laughs> mm. hey. And you know, you have loved ones on campus. People who are watching you right now. People who are lo who have logged in into campus style on YouTube, Instagram, Snapchat, just to watch your beautiful face. So what should they expect from you as the years continue? Yes. Expect that Asa continues to be the virtuous, a good woman she is. Yes, I am maintaining that reputation of being a virtuous woman, a woman, a woman of substance, a woman that is responsible and can manage her home, a woman that is not only beautiful on the outside, but her inner beauty characterized by a high sense of dignity and standard of intelligence. That is the virtuous, a woman that. I would maintain right oh, from here. Mommy, also for mommy. Yeah. May also for mommy. Hey. Hey. Okay. Wow, I should look. Also for mommy. Yeah. It's who now? Uti mi chano mesa kwaba. Uti mi so chano mesa so. And I also to meet chano. Also for mommy. It's and we are so grateful you came on this, you know, this program to talk to us, to have this interview with us. We are so blessed to have you here. We hope that when we call on you again, you would sure. make take the step sure. towards us. Sure. Thank you. God bless you. And viewers, Aso, Aso, your viewers. Hi. Now, before we run out, this is the Campus Celebrity Show brought to you by Campus Style. And you know, you can find us on all social media handles. Just type in campus style and your K is K, not a C. And you stay in all the time, log into YouTube, log into Snapchat, watch us, watch someone like Aso. Yes, so Australian She has a glorious smile, in fact. And thank you so much for tuning in today. To be with Thank us you, and we are here at Nel Giardino and one of our sponsors also is the Palazzo Makeover. Thank you so much for tuning in with us. Shout out to everyone. Miss Miss Asso, do you do you want to give a shout out yes, to Yes, shout out to my my girls in the fashion department shout outs to my hostel mates and shout outs to my baby jesse yes and everybody yes. <laughs> Thank you so. hey yeah your friend is jesse oh. hey.